You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host, and I have a familiar face to BCA viewers. I have uh, my friend Rayford Marshall. Hey, Ray, my how pleasure. are you doing? My pleasure. Um, you're very involved over at Lincoln Congregational Church, yeah. and um, last year was the 120th anniversary of the church. This year's the 121st, and you have a whole weekend, a whole weekday and weekend series of events, starting October 10th, 11th, 12th, and 14th. There's no 13th in there, there's just the 14th. Correct. So tell us about it. Tell us what's going on. Well, first of all, uh, the congregation of uh, Lincoln Church Ministries, we really appreciate you, Mark. My pastor, Reverend uh, Houston Creighton, loves you. And uh, we really appreciate what you do for us. Just like you said, last year you let us come on and make the announcement. And this year, that was 120. This year, it's 121. Mm -hmm. 121st anniversary. That's quite a long time. And we're going to feature uh, the 10th, 11th, and 12th, and 14th. We're going to have Bishop Samuel Dalton come in on the 10th. And uh, that program is going to start around you know, 7 in the, in the evening. And uh, on the 11th, uh, we're going to have Reverend George Bullock. Uh, Mount Calvary Church in Boston, and uh, by the way, uh, Bishop Dalton is from Word of Life Tabernacle Church in Roxbury. Mm -hmm. And then on, on the 12th, on the 12th, we're going to have uh, Reverend Art Gordon come in from St. John's Missionary Baptist Church. That's in Roxbury. Mm -hmm. There's some local uh, pastors, but on the 14th, we're going to have Pastor Palmer coming in from Air Mass, New Hope Community Church in Air Mass. And he's so, uh, he helps us out so much. He's, he's going to have his service during the, the morning, and him and his members are going to jump in the cars, trucks, and, uh, and buses and come down and fellowship with us. And, of course, that means that we will have to feed them when they come. So anyone that comes on Sunday, Mm -hmm. At the 4 o'clock program, they come right after they leave their church and they get there around 2.30 or so, we're going to have correlation. And we're going to have choirs come in. It's the 121st. Mm -hmm. How many churches get to have 121st? It's a long time. And, and uh, <clears throat> Lincoln Church Ministry started out as uh, Lincoln Congregational Church. You know, and uh, we're talking back in 1897. Right. We've had 17, 17 pastors come and pastor this wow. church. Wow. We, we moved off of Appleton Street down to Whale Street. That's where it was dedicated. And um, in 1986, Pastor Houston Creighton came. Mm -hmm. And he's been there ever since. And we moved from Whale Street to 180 Oak Street. Right, which is right across from Fairway Oaks. Yeah, you got the storage place over there. Yes. You have the new uh, cleaners yes. that are yes. over there, Crown Western, Cleaners, Western Bank. Yeah, and, and a lot of people might not realize what what all is on Oak Street, but we're not too far from DW Golf Course. Exactly, DW Fields. But we're not playing golf. <laughs> no, no, no. You got the but, but, you got the religion on, and we love your Reverend Creighton as well. He's a wonderful man. I met him back when he came here oh, a yeah. long, long time ago. Um, some of the first things I covered on TV involved him. Yes. He, so he, he's going strong. That's a long time. That's longevity oh, yes. uh, for, 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 for a pastor. Yes. At one time, we had as low as five members. Now we're up to 275. Mm -hmm. And this pastor, he's a veteran. He's been military time, going to UMass, doctorates and degrees. And uh, his love, his heart, is the fellowship with God. The fellowship with God is his most, because he also taught in the Boston public school system. And he came down to a point, what are you going to do? Right. And he took up the community. And he's an advocate for Brockton. And you life. guys, you have um, debates and things that happen at the church so oh, people yeah. can be involved in the community. Um, it's a, it, the people that are part of your congregation are very involved in the community, much like yourself. You, you're spreading the word by doing your show, Gospel Vineyard. Yes, Gospel Vineyard. We have a lot of uh, people that come into our, our church. We 
bring him on to that show. And all because he opened the doors for us, just as he has opened the doors to the community. Um, if we have funerals, he opens the door. He don't turn people down. No, you know, it, no. It, it, definitely we have an outreach program. He has a food pantry there. Uh, he has a, a program for the elderly. He has a program for the youth. And it just goes on and on and on and on. And there's so much work to be done. So, yeah, we welcome a lot of people come and visit us. But this is going to be a great time. So we got know? one, two, three, four days. Uh, the only day we're not doing is Saturday, and the times are seven on three of the days, the 10th, the 11th, and the 12th, and Sunday it's four. Four. Okay. And if you come early, we're going to have correlation. And, and one thing about a community church, we have a lot of people that love to cook and yeah. love to serve. How much better is it to fellowship over a, a bite to eat? Well, I was there for the dedication. Yes. I got to figure out a way. My, my wife's birthday is on Monday. <laughs> so we were doing some of the family stuff on Sunday. But right. you never know. You never know. She likes coming with me. We came for the dedication. She's come with me for the debates. And, you know, they welcome everybody of all faiths oh, with yes. open, uh, yeah. open arms. Open and, nation. You know. All nations. So um, you gave the address. Is, do you have a website for the church? The or the we, we can put it up on screen if, oh, if yeah. you... It, the website is lincolnchurchministries.org. There we go. lincolnchurchministries.org. Okay. And uh, as you have already mentioned, yeah, a lot of the groups, uh, events that happens in Brockton, we, we open our doors to them. We oh. open our doors. And you have a beautiful church. Uh, it took a long time to do that. Three uh, years old. Yeah, it's three years old, but it took a while to do because oh. it, it, it was a it was a struggle. But anything that's a struggle is it's, worth it. It's worth it. Yeah, yeah. God wanted him to have it. He wanted us to have it, and now we're in there, and we just welcome all. We don't turn anyone down. You know, uh, my pastor's uh, ultimate goal is for everyone to have a relationship with the Savior and Lord. You know, and it's not about religion. It's about the relationship that we have with this, with the Savior and the Lord. Well, I love the music wow. when you guys do the music. Music makes it all. You know, you think about what links people together. It's, it's family. It's God. It's music, and of course, you added food. Yes. So you get the food. <laughs> you're all set. Everybody, everybody's happy with that. And we got choir. Each minister, each pastor is bringing their choir. Oh, okay. There's some guest choir is going to come. Uh, we have several. We have a praise team at Lincoln. Mm -hmm. We have the choir, and we have the men's witness. Yeah. It's going to be a good time. Well, it's going to be a good time. Thank you for spreading the word in many ways for your show and by promoting this. And we thank you. We're glad to. Okay. Always a pleasure. You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Linda, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.